in the cut. <sighs> Yes, please. Offer here, please. Thank you so much. Could I get both, red and green? Oh, that's perfect. Thank you so much. All right, we just got our food. This looks amazing. I got loaded up nachos and three tacos. And the thing is here, they do not skimp. They be loading it like crazy. Insane amount of cheese. It's like a mountain on top of the tacos and the nachos. Anything you get here, they put all this cheese on. And this cheese is amazing, especially mixed with all these meats. First one I'm gonna hit is this asada, the OG one. I'm gonna put a little of this red salsa. From what I remember, this is hella spicy. Mmm. Ooh. Yeah, this red salsa is super spicy. But I swear, it adds so much flavor. Smokiness too. Then you get the creaminess from the sour cream and guac to cool it down. All the toppings give it so much life. Mmm, I love that cheese. It's so packed, flavorful and complex. It's so much to comprehend while you're eating because there's an insane amount of toppings. Just gotta keep like re-layering it. As it falls off, just keep putting it back on top. I'm gonna try the green salsa though. It smells good. It smells limey. Mmm, it kind of reminds me of like an enchilada sauce. It has a limey kick and you could just throw it on everything. Both are really good though. All right, these nachos are looking at me. We have to get a bite of this. My meat of choice is cabeza. The textures of the cabeza look so diverse. There's like some crunchy pieces, soft, fatty pieces, topped off with the cheese, salsa, cabbage, guac. Let's dig in. It's so hard, I don't even know where to start, but I'm gonna get a fork actually and like dig through here, right here. Oh, check that out. That's a huge bite. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get that bite. Right here. Whoa. Whoa. Oh yeah, that looks so good. Mmm. It's my first time ordering cabeza and nachos. I didn't know it would be this good. But I feel like here makes it so much better with this cheese. It's not like a, you know, um, like your traditional like nacho yellow cheese. This cheese here is like shredded, so soft, not in your mouth, thin. The flavors go so well with the beef and the everything. I mean, the cabbage adds crunch. And then what I do like too is these nachos, they're like thicker tortilla chips. You saw that huge bite. That was one chip holding all that up. Amazing. Let's get this bite right here. I could probably eat this whole thing in one sitting. It's huge, but so addicting with all the different textures and flavors. Mmm. Wow. All right, next taco we're gonna eat is the pastor, marinated pork. Like, come on, this one taco right here. It's so heavy, oh my gosh. And it just fell off like a big chunk. Let me get, see that? You just gotta get it up like that. <laughs> you don't need a lot of the salsa because it's pretty bold and spicy, so. A little goes a long way. Let's get this bite. Mmm. This is not no light meal, this is heavy, but really good so soft every bite it just like blows out it's crazy mm. so good man last taco we got a hit right here i know it's gonna be good because we got the cabeza and the nachos this is the cabeza taco that red salsa is so good cheers mmm it's crazy how soft that meat is. So fall apart, tender, fatty, crispy at the same time. Such a good meat. If you haven't had cabeza, you should try it. It's not what you think it would taste like or the texture would be like, but it's probably one of my favorite meats in a taco. Yeah, and this location is dope because it's on the busy street. And this guy just pulled up right next to us selling esquites right here in the parking lot. So which uh, flavors do you have for the rest, Father? Could I do the uh, nuez y coco? Si, sí, gracias.
Cuatro? Cuatro. Gracias. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much. Have a good one. It's crazy, man. I, I didn't think I'd be eating one of these today, but came here for the tacos. They pulled up with their lotes and raspados. Got nuez y coco, which is pecan and coconut. Looks legit. I'm gonna just mix it around because I see all the coconut on the bottom. I want to get the best bite. This looks good and it smells so good. Mmm. That's good. Wow. Very nutty, not too sweet. Every time I go to Mexico or any raspado place, this is like the number one flavor. It's nuez. So glad I finally tried it. It's really good. I would definitely get this again. I actually can't taste the coconut at all. Just taste that nutty flavor. The creaminess, so good. Amazing meal right now for just pulling up on the spot. But as always, thank you guys for watching in the cut. Till next time, we out.